Hi guys and welcome to Motor Planet where today we're going to be showing you around a 2017 Vauxhall Insignia. Now this one in particular has a beautiful spec, it is the SRI NAV um, VX line as well. So it comes with a beautiful spec, some really nice styling features and what we're going to do today is just give you a general insight into what we've got for sale. So show you around, talk about some of the spec that's on the car, show you the bodywork. Like I say, just to give you a bit of an insight into what we've got for sale. So starting from the front and working our way back, we've got some really nice styling with it being the VXR line, um, meaning that you just get some nice little kit on the side. So you get the side skirts and the bumpers are slightly different, uh, just a little bit more aggressive uh, and a bit more of a sporty feel. You've also uh, got a really nice design in the headlights um, with the black and chrome. It just looks really, really smart and it suits the car really well uh, with some of the darker features. The wheels are absolutely gorgeous. Take a look at them. So they're an 18 inch diamond cut wheel with a grey inserts and it looks fabulous. They are a brilliant looking wheel. Again, just a nice sporty feel. It really brings the car together. Now moving around the side, as you can see, lovely paintwork. It's in almost mint condition. Uh, what I am going to do on this video is show you the marks on the car. So the ones that we've seen are just back here, your usual slight wear and tear. Just from getting things in and out of the boot, other than that, the car is immaculate. Really, really nice car. It's only covered 30,000 miles as well on its brilliant diesel engine. It's barely running for these diesel engines. They're 167 brake horsepower, nearly 300 foot pound of torque, and only 30 pounds a year road tax because of how good the miles per gallon is on these. So you're going to get plenty of power, loads of grunt, uh, brilliant for the motorway miles, but also brilliant miles per gallon, so it's not going to cost you a hell of a lot to run. It's only group uh, 23 insurance, I think, off the top of my head. So again, not bad at all. Uh, a really nice family car, which is affordable. Now, if you haven't driven one of these, get yourselves down to test drive it. They drive like a dream. Vauxhall have really upped the game with these cars, and they are fabulous. The drive is brilliant. Everything's nice and tight and comfortable, but the interior has plenty of spec to keep you busy as well. So let's get on. Let's move on to the interior, show you some of the spec there. Just before we move on to the interior, let me talk about another bonnet. Let's run through them figures once again. So underneath here is Vauxhall's four-cylinder turbocharged engine. It is a diesel engine producing around 167 brake horsepower. So it's no slouch. It also produces up to 295 foot-pound of torque. So it's got loads of grunt, loads of low-end grunt there. It also produces up to 74 miles per gallon, don't get me wrong, in ideal conditions, but it results in a nice 30 pound a year road tax charge. So it's gonna cost you next to nothing to run. Now moving around to the boot space, as you'll probably already have guessed, there is plenty of space in the back of there. I do apologise, it's a bit dark and it's a bit hard to see, but there is loads of room, absolutely plenty. Um, you do also have the option to fold down the rear seats as well and around a 70-30 split. It's also got all of the Isofix points for your, uh, for your car seats and all of your anchor points as well. It's got your door locks for the children as well in the back. It's quite a family orientated car and nice and safe. Privacy glass towards the rear. The seats are in lovely condition with the two-tone with the white stitching. It looks gorgeous and it's super comfortable as well. You've also got some nice pockets there and a 12 volt charging socket for the children in the back. Moving around to the front of the car, again, very nice modern styling from the door cards. You've got all of your wing mirror switches and your door locks with some nice ambient lighting as well. And you've also got your window switches just down here with the all important window lock for the children in the back. We've got some nice Vauxhall chrome kick plates there, height adjustable driver's seat, loads of lumbar support, super, super comfortable. Sports pedals as well with it being the VX line. Now let's get on onto the interior. Let's flick the lights on as well just to give you a bit of a look at how these are. There you go. So a beautiful looking set of clocks, nice little needle sweep giving it a bit of a sporty feel. But as you can see, the mileage just down there, just over 30,000 miles, which is nothing for these cars. Now, the dash to world in general is super, super clean, really nice. You've got all of this uh, black trim just around the edge, which has a really nice design to it when you look up close. Uh, it's the attention to detail for me, the small things which uh, make me really like some of these cars, and the design on this one is gorgeous. 
Now, your centre display has uh, quite a large touchscreen, to be fair. I'm not sure how big it is. It's around 9 inch, I'd say. Um, but plenty of different options on here. So let me just go into the menu for you, just to show you. So you've got all of your audio, uh, FM, AM, DAB, connecting your phone up to the car, as you can see there. Projection as well. So the projection means it's basically once you've connected your phone up to the car, whatever's on your phone screen will be on there. Uh, so if you wanted to watch movies or something like that, um, and project something from your phone onto the screen, you can do. It's also got navigation. Again, brilliant thing to have. Making sure you get home nice and safe. And plenty more other little bits and bobs on there, uh, just like text messages and stuff like that. Your settings, probably time and dates and bits and bobs like that, and your traffic announcements. So it's quite an intelligent screen with loads of different features on. It'll keep you busy going through them. Now, a little bit further down, you've got your climate control and air conditioning. Again, nice and easy to use. Nice little display down here. Super, super simple. That's all it needs to be. Now, it has a six-speed manual gearbox and having that extra sixth gear just lets it idle a lot nicer on the motorway, bringing them miles per gallon up and resulting in a nice low fuel cost. It drives brilliantly with this manual gearbox. And if you haven't driven one, like I say, come and take one for a test drive. You get so much car for your money with these. There's also loads of storage pockets as well. Plenty of cubby holes, loads of storage. Uh, just there, you've got a USB and AUX socket as well. Uh, last but not least, some of your controls on your steering wheel. So you've got a full leather steering wheel with a slight flat bottom as well, giving it a bit of a sporty feel. Now this is full leather and it is really nice and soft. Um, it's a beautiful steering wheel to be fair. A very nice modern design as well. You've also got all of your buttons for your cruise control and speed limiter and your hands free. And all of your media controls on the opposite side. You've also got your wipers obviously on your stalks and your indicators. And automatic lights just towards the right hand side of your steering wheel. And a couple more cubby holes as well, so plenty of storage in this car. Right, I think that sort of wraps it up. Let's get to the top. So, we've got a beautiful spec on the interior and some gorgeous features. Everything is super, super clean in this car. The bodywork is in lovely condition. It's been very, very well kept. Like I say, these are the only marks that we've noticed on the car and it's absolutely nothing. It's got a gorgeous spec, a brilliant two litre diesel engine up front. What more could you need? Well, we're gonna make sure that this car is A-OK -okay for the next keeper. We're gonna make sure it's got a full 12 month MOT on with no advisories whatsoever. We're gonna make sure it has a full pre-delivery inspection to ensure quality with our vehicles. We're gonna give you a three month nationwide parts and labor warranty to look after you, not just now, but in the long run as well. And it's gonna get serviced before it leaves so that everything is ready for the next keeper. And the next keeper doesn't have to spend a penny until the next MOT is due. So, if you do need more information, feel free to hit us up on our website or give us a call on 0161 335 9972. I'm bound to have missed plenty of details on this car. So, there will be loads more pictures and information on our website. So, do feel free to get in contact as well. We have great delivery options, uh, finance options, and extended warranties if necessary. So, do feel free to get in contact for your tailored quotes. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. See you soon.